Okay, so I've recently got Mink V2, and it's really amazing. So, I want to show you guys how to get Mink V2 in today's video, so let's get right into it. So, first up, you want to go ahead and do Bartimaleo's quest. So, you got to be level, I believe, 850, or it was it 950? I think it's 850. You want to go ahead and defeat 50, 50 Swan Pirates. Swan Pirates right over here, so you defeat 50 of them. After you defeat 50 of them, you want to go ahead and defeat Jeremy. Which is right over there. It's pretty easy. So after that, you want to go ahead and free the, the prisoners in the Colosseum. So, and there's a little puzzle. So let me show you guys real quick. So you go over here to the Colosseum. Right here. You want to go ahead and free these guys. I've already done it. And you can see to free them, there's these puzzles that you have to go and complete. So to find these puzzles, and you got to put them in order, you want to go to over here to the wall and all the way to palace so up over here so the palace is right over here and it'll tell you the same exact pattern and that you have to follow so after you have completed that and you just entered the right code it will free them and then and you'll receive the warrior helmet warrior helmet is uh, an accessory for your head it's pretty good and all right after you have completed Bartimaleo's quest, you want to go ahead and go all the way to green zone. Okay, so after you've made it to green zone, you want to go ahead and follow me where I'm going. Let me just get this blue chest. So you want to go over here, right behind, right there. Yeah, so the quest guy is going to be over there. You just follow all the way to this pattern and to this leaf. You want to go ahead and talk to the art alchemist, alchemist, and he'll tell you that you need to find me three flowers, three flowers, the red, blue, and yellow. So let me show you guys all the location for all those flowers. First flower, the red flower, only spawns at daylight. So the first spawn area location we have is over here, exactly where I am, like right in the middle. You'll see it right in the middle all the way over here you it will be in the mansion palace mansion whatever you want to call it so it'll be in one of these places so like the garden or something and the third area location is right over here which spawns most likely over here for the next flower we have the blue flower and I own I know two locations only. if you guys know any other locations comment down below follow where I'm going to where diamonds located so right over here, then you want to go straight where you see those big rocky pillars or something like that, whatever you want to call it. Arrive here is around level 900. So the flower spawns on top of the graves, somewhere around here. It's a little blue flower, pretty easy to spot. And yeah, so for the next location is right on that tiny little mountain. So you want to go over here, there's entrance right over here. And if you go up here, and the blue flower will be over here. There's one more location, but I do not remember where it is. So the flower, the blue flower will certainly most likely spawn over here. So for the last and final flower, it's the yellow flower that you could get from any NPC by just defeating them. So I killed the swan pirates, which took me like three quests of doing the swan pirates and then I got the yellow flower. So it's pretty easy, pretty simple, but it does take a little bit of time. So after you've done that, you wanna go ahead and go back to green zone. I forgot to say this, but make sure you have 500,000 500,000 um, belly and you talk to the alchemist and then he'll ask for to pay 500,000 belly and then you just pay him and then there you'll get mink v2 mink v2 just extends the dash so it's pretty long and you run faster it's really cool and really fun to have so yeah that's pretty much all for today's video if you guys enjoyed today's video make sure to like subscribe turn up the bell and i'll see you guys in the next one